and I'm joined by the founder and also CEO of this uh, company, Michael Mlinga. Welcome to the show. Thanks for having me. Um, very, very innovative mind that you are, <laughs> by <laughs> the you. way. I'll start off with that compliment and mm -hmm. we get straight into it. Yeah. This application, the inspiration and the motivation to mm -hmm. come up with this particular idea, just run us through that. Okay, so, I mean, it came from um, personally looking at sometimes, you know, I might be uh, looking for a service mm -hmm. or a product and, you know, I'd have to ask a friend through WhatsApp or ask someone if they know someone that knows someone, you know what I mean? Mm. But, um, so we thought, how can we make this an easier process? How can you easily search for products and services locally? I mean, not just by name, but, you know, by dimension, by color, mm -hmm. by location, and all those things. And we thought, let's put that together in one app that makes it easier mm -hmm. for the people who are selling uh, the services and products and the people who want to buy them as well. Mm -hmm. yeah. I think the best ideas really come through when you experience a particular problem yourself. Yeah. You're like, ah, I need to do something about this. Mm -hmm. But how long did it take you just coming up with this idea? Because mm -hmm. I know for people, it's always in the pipeline and yeah. some, what... Maybe others didn't have this idea, but it took them a while to actually yeah. get it started. So how long did it take you to come up with this idea and mm -hmm. actually make it happen? Okay, so basically um, I run a company with my partner, okay. uh, Neonova Technologies. Right. So we sat down and strategized to say, okay, look, we're a digital marketing company. How can we use our skills and our services to create uh, a new platform or a new service? Mm -hmm. So in terms, of, in terms of planning and execution, you'd say it take about six to eight months basically okay. to have something done this way. Mm -hmm. Because we wanted to make sure that not only does the system provide the service we wanted to do, but it should be up to a certain standard True. that people can say, yeah. no, this is polished, this is actually mm -hmm. something that they can continue using, mm -hmm. you know, not just from the first installation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right, because I, another thing I've noticed about certain companies, especially locally, mm -hmm. when you play the local card or mm -hmm. support local, local is lacquer, mm -hmm. but sometimes the product is not actually yeah. uh, as good. So. We are glad that we can be guaranteed of, uh, of that through this application. Mm -hmm. But how many people are actually on board mm -hmm. to make sure that this is a success? How I many people are building this? So maybe, mm -hmm. maybe you and your partner only who developed it? No, no, no. So we are based in Neonova as a company. Mm -hmm. We have about 11 people in the, uh, the company. So we have developers, we have uh, graphics designers, we've got a marketing team and so on. So mm -hmm. it's not just a small independent project mm -hmm. to say. But there's a lot of um, work and uh, talent going into the system to not just make sure that it could come out, but that we can maintain it and keep uh, providing dynamic content mm. and features for this uh, system. Mm. All right, interesting. Mm -hmm. So let's get to now the, how, how the app actually works. works. So yeah. you, you download the application, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You get through it. First of all, also hoping it's user friendly. Mm -hmm. So you get there and how does it work? Like, if I have a product, mm -hmm. do I go on the application and mm -hmm. say, oh, hey, I have this, mm -hmm. and uh, you can buy it. It's now available. How does it yeah. work? Okay, so if you had to go on, you download the app, uh -huh. um, you register, obviously. Um, once you're registered, you can post up to three products and or services for free, absolutely free. Okay. And then when you, when you, so you create your account, and then you say, okay, for example, this is the name of my product. Mm -hmm. This is what it is. You can briefly describe it. Um, also, we have tags and attributes you can att attribute to your product. Okay. So, for example, you could say, okay, this is, for example, let's say it's a car you're selling. Mm. You could say, okay, this is automatic transmission. This is how much mileage it has, um, the color, the make, and so on. And then when you post that, um, it gets reviewed for the maximum up to one working day, just to make sure that everything that's on the site is, you know, we can say it's within posting guidelines and so on. Mm -hmm. And once you post that, it's available. So anyone that goes on the site, and maybe it comes across your product, or they're searching for a car, mm -hmm. they will find that, and they can communicate with you directly to say, oh, actually, I've seen this car, I've seen mm -hmm. the pictures you've put, um, how can we you know, get this deal over the line? Because mm -hmm. yeah. I'm also aware that uh, companies can also get on board, stores mm -hmm. can get on yep. board if they only sell the products, but before mm -hmm. we talk about that, mm -hmm. um, how do you make sure that it's, these people who are posting things are, are genuine, mm -hmm. are legit, because the last thing we want to have is, is a situ situation where we are duped and, mm -hmm. It's not real. You get to meet this person and the product is it's not, not what was advertised. Yeah, that's a very important part. And that's why we, one, have a lot of, um, like we said, first, when something's uploaded, we ensure that, you know, it, it's within our uh, gu guidelines to say it's legitimate, mm -hmm. basically. So we also communicate with the people selling sometimes to find out, you know, the product that they're selling. And one of the, the big things is the power of the community. So when you find a product on Tigule, you can actually rate it or review your experience 
with that seller on okay. their profile or that specific product. Ah, nice. Exactly. So yeah. someone else that might come across them will see, oh, actually, this is the rating that this person has or these are the okay. experiences they have. Mm -hmm. So it also, the community also helps you know, you know which sellers to deal with mm -hmm. uh, in the future as well. All right, nice. And then for the, for the stores, the mm -hmm. actual stores, um, how do they get on board the same way? You get yeah. to register? Yeah, so with the stores, um, it's a bit of a different process because um, what they'll do is, yeah, they register with us. Uh, we get all of the information. And with the different packages we have, we actually provide uh, some of the posting for the companies. Okay. So some companies might say, look, we don't have the time to go and put, uh, let's say, 10, 20 different products we have in stock. So part of our team will work with them to make sure those products are uploaded uh, based on their schedule, if they have discounts and stuff like that. So those are some of the benefits of having um, one of the higher subscriptions okay. on Tigule. Right. Right. Yeah. Very, very interesting so far. So it's very, very simple. Just have to download it. Mm -hmm. uh, it's available on Google Play Store. It's also available on the Apple Store. And you can also visit the website, which is tigule.com. Yeah. And uh, so far, any challenges that you've faced? Well, I know it's never easy. It's never easy, <laughs> but it's been very exciting. Uh -huh. You know, it's, uh, um, I must say one of the main things we've been trying to push is, um, you know, support to support the uh, Zambian products. Yeah. By supporting sellers, letting people showcase the things that maybe you might not have seen. You know, there might be something that someone is, you know, preparing that not a lot of people know about, but Tigula is helping them uh, get out there. Mm. And I also would say that I'm happy with the support that we're receiving, yeah. you know, because it's something that we're trying to push and hopefully this can grow. And you never know, other, other people will be looking at Zambia and saying, wow, they have a really cool platform mm. that they created locally. I bet someone is looking forward to me asking this question. Probably mm -hmm. asking themselves this question wherever they are. Mm -hmm. how, uh, how are you in turn making your money? Okay, so the way, <laughs> <laughs> the way it works basically is we have different uh, subscriptions. Uh -huh. So you can post up to three products every 30 days for free. If you want to post five, then you only pay 20 kwacha. And then if you are a company or a shop, then there's a subscription cost to that as well. So that's the, the only you know, uh, model there. In yeah. terms of saying that you're trying to make money off the, the platform. Okay. All right. Very, very interesting. Yeah. And uh, we definitely wish you all the best with uh, this particular product. I know mm -hmm. it's been two weeks so far running. Yeah, the app, two weeks now. Mm -hmm. uh, the website's been about a month or so. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, we're definitely excited to push this platform forward. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Well, once again, you can look out for it and get downloaded and use it. And let's see who's going to be legit through those ratings. Mm. And right about now, uh, by the way, thank you so much for coming through. Yeah, thank you so much for having me. All right. So right now we get straight into our Sunday motivation, something to keep you inspired and motivated throughout the rest of the week.